Good morning my friends and welcome back to another fossil hunting episode Today here we are in this eucalyptus I don't know how to call it, uh, maybe forest So I came here for the first time I never, I never went, I never came here to search for fossils So this is my first time here uh, scouting and searching for fossils so as you can see the road passes down there let's see what we can find in here it's a beautiful spring morning here in portugal today it's sort of uh, an exploratory run well I don't know where do you live guys but up here in Portugal it's very common to have eucalyptus a bit everywhere but it's not cool I prefer pine trees I'm not a koala <laughs> well my friends it's turning out a bit disappointing to me because I cannot seem to find not a single indicator of, of the presence of fossils around here despite the fact that there are the plenty of rocks but nothing zit <sighs> okay I guess this one is not going to YouTube <laughs> hmm Let's go check these rocks around here. They are a little bit different from the other ones. Oh. No, they are not different. Almost the same. The same stuff. Mm. Nothing new around here. I guess I'm wasting my time. Oh, but take a look. Oh, I said take a look again. <laughs> this one is muddy. Looks like sedimentary deposit or something like that. Okay. Hmm. Well guys, fossil hunting could be a dangerous thing, uh, you know, you think is you are pretty safe around here and we start walking and there is a giant cliff over there, more about 10 to 15 meters, so I better stay off here because in the middle of the night we could easily die in here if you end up running in this direction well someone did a nice campfire in here but pretty interesting choice of rocks let me see this one around here oh well, I was looking at these rocks because uh, they seem to... Oh, there is pieces of a shell over here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Plenty of ants. Oh, what's this? What's this over here? Oh my god. And there is a spider also. Woo. Oh, a spider. And ants over everywhere. What is this? I don't know what is this. Nice. There seems to be... There seems to be fossils in this campfire. Oh my god. Okay, let's investigate this better. Despite this little thing over here, that I don't know what it is, there is something unusual on this side also. Let me see if the camera does the zoom. There is something in here also and there are remnants of fossils in this rock. Well, I will try to see if I can extract some for you guys. 
let's get working. Friends, what do you think about this? Let me see if I can get closer. Whoa. Well, well, for you guys that love minerals, this one, take a look. <laughs> it looks like it, it was made by a machine, but it's not. Very cool. It has that, that look of a cake, of several layers cake. Well, but this continues on over there. Very cool. Okay. What's this? Some kind of berries. I'm not going to eat that. I don't know what it is. <laughs> well, but this side over here is very cool. This wavy pattern is very very distinctive and I think I don't remember found anything like that so oh but this is big oh this continues on over here mm, real cool well I was inspecting this a little bit closer I was looking at the crystal formations and what about this Are these crystals too? It almost looks like organic stuff in here. Organic but uh, solidified. See? Hmm. I don't know. This looks to me like it is mineral but not sure. Okay, let's continue. Take a look. I was looking inside of this huge rock that is in here. I didn't saw any signs of marine life, but the shape of the rocks, I don't know. I think I saw this someplace else, but... Oh, there's a leaf. There's... Sorry. There's... Oh! There's a spider web over here, and there seems to be a, a rock that is a bit unusual. Let me see if I can take it this out. Looks like round. Let me check this. Okay. Okay. It's not a fossil, but it contains a fossil. Something curly in there. And this looks like coral to me. I don't know if this is zooming, but it looks like coral. All right. Yes, it is coral. Take a look. Wow, corals. Yay. See? Wow, cool. I'm in the right spot. Whoa, it's a coral, so marine life could be could be right over here. <laughs> Take a good look. There is some these holes over here are are corals indeed, and it was right over there in that spot just beneath this rock and let me take a pan for you guys to see it is in is over there so i will see if i can find some more stuff let's see well this is looking cool what about this rock over here it looks like whoa Whoa! Oh, let me see first if there is any bug. No, it's not. Whoa, cool! Take a look at this. Look at this pattern over here. So cool! 
This is characteristic from corals. Whoa, that is nice. Yeah. I don't know what species of coral this is, but this is a fossil, all right. And a good looking one. <laughs> oh, nice. What is this over here? Could this be a spine from a sea urchin? Whoa, I have to wash this real, real good. Nice, 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 nice coin. <laughs> well, my friends, I was digging a little bit more over here. I have to be careful because I don't know if this rock is stable or not. But uh, I want you to see this rock over here. At first glance, meh, there is nothing, nothing in here. But if I zoom it, take a look, all of this, I believe it's a coral. I don't know if you guys are seeing this, but it has a nice pattern. Okay, take a good look at here. Here you can see that web pattern well this is real real good so far i managed to find some corals and some little stuff like spines of sea urchins sea urchins i didn't find any but looking at these rocks this one i didn't uh, saw anything special but it seems that there is a, there are remains of little organisms sea organisms and I'm pretty sure that there is something more around I just need to keep on searching this one I will bring with me and I will see after uh, a good cleaning what is going to pop out from here okay well, I think I spot something that could be interesting. Take a look. It's very disguised here in the rocks. But see this? This could be, I don't know, a shell. But it doesn't look like one. It only, it only has these wavy lines over here. But if I do like that, you can see, oh. You can see that there is some wavy lines in here so I pretty much bet that this is a shell a pectin shell I believe but that one will stay there because it's real real inside the rock and I'm not going to waste time so uh, let's continue so my friends, this is the end result of today's hunt. I didn't bring all the rocks that I collect today in here because in my opinion this, these are the best ones that I managed to, to collect and I just want to show you some of the nice details that some of this has. You can see that there are plenty of stuff inside. And I believe with the magnifying glass it will be pretty awesome to find all the little animals and corals that live in this habitat. Let me see if I can zoom it this way in here. Okay, this is just one of the of the rocks that I collected this side it's still wet because I cleaned it just a while ago this one for me it's the best one one of the best I don't know if you guys are seeing the detail of this but it's pretty awesome because I never uh, 
imagine that that could be corals in that area over there and it's pretty amazing that there are still remnants of some reefs I believe see oh I don't know if it's okay it's zooming now okay this is just one of them and this one You can see all the nice. I don't know the specific name of the um, the coral. I will see it in the the books. But it's pretty awesome. This side, I don't know what that thing is over there. Maybe a spine from a sea urchin. I don't know pretty cool okay this one has also corals so guys it's pretty much about hit for today's episode. I hope you like. See you soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.